Hello viewers, this is Jetha Mopilog Studios. I thank you for watching the previous video in case you did. If you missed it, go ahead and watch that video even before continuing this very one. Or maybe you can watch it later. Uh, today I want to talk about how you can craft a commercial, basically scripting, because everything starts with scripting. If you're not good at scripting or you hate writing, uh, this is a beginner video, still you can catch up and learn how to write. Even me, I'm not good at writing, but still I try my level best to write something small uh, that I can present to my client when it comes to making commercial videos. Because there is no way going to make a good commercial video or explainer video or promo, whatever you call it, when you don't know how to write a script. So if you are interested, stick around till the end of it all. A beginner or intermediate, this is a video for you. Without further ado, let's get started. I try to make this a little bit simple for you to understand because this is for beginners, people who are starting out to make a commercial videos but you don't know where to start from. I try to break it down to four steps only, but you can make this wider to seven steps to eight steps or even watch other people's videos because they have talked about this one. You can go and watch emotionally. Uh, he talked about it very well and explained it in details. The link is down in the description and you can even go and watch other videos on YouTube. Explain a video or a demo or a promo video are the first steps needed to make a perfect one. Uh, as you can see on the screen, we have the problem in the number one position and two, we have the solution. Number three, we have the difference and the number four, we have uh, call to action. Uh, this may sound weird to you or new to you, but I'm going to try to break this down for you so that guys, you can master it clearly. As we say, the number one, that is problem. A problem, what does problem really mean? Uh, you should know what the problem you're going to solve or what does this commercial going to solve what does the service the client is is providing or the product what problem what kind of problem is it going to solve address the problem that is first by your target audience think like them to be able to evoke the emotions if you try to think like the way the audience is thinking to empathize with them Trust me, you're going to be able to talk to their problem and address it clearly so that you can evoke their emotions. There is an explainer video I tried to get, or yes, an explainer video I got for you guys, and we're going to follow it as we continue. Kate and Rick just bought a new home and they're super excited, but it looks so empty. They tried to search for furniture, but it's all just too plain and boring, and they want their home to really stand out. And then a good friend recommended Culture. At Culture, we create individual collections to outfit entire rooms, homes, or apartments. Look how happy Kate and Rick are. Modern furniture from leading designers just one click away and at super affordable prices. Welcome to Culture. That bought a, bought a house, but the house was empty. It had no furniture and they didn't know where to start from. So that is a problem right there. You know the problem you're trying to solve is furniture. How can someone access furniture? How can they get furniture to their house? So the script goes like this. I removed the name of the couple. I tried to put my name and the name of my wife. Jotham and Joy bought a new home and they are super excited, but it looks so empty. They try to search for furniture, but it's all too plain and boring. And they want their home to really stand out. Have you realized the problem, guys? The problem here is that the loom is so plain and empty and it is very boring. So that is the problem right there that you need to address properly like it was being addressed in this commercial. After talking about the problem very well and addressing it clearly, so you need to provide the solution about the stated problem, the problem that you are trying to address. Tell the viewers how your product or service solve that problem. Quaricha here is a solution because they provide individual collections to outfit entire loom, meaning they are able to solve the problem you're going through of a plain boiling house by providing you a collection of outfits. 
that can properly outf uh, outfit the room, homes, and apartment. And the number three step is the difference. Now, whenever you're writing down this commercial or explainer video, make sure that you try to address how different, how unique the product really is, how different the service really is. Yes, we're providing the furniture to a couple or to an empty boiling room, but how unique is your furniture? Number four step, you have to call to action. Calling to action means, yes, people have watched, you've showed them the solution, you've addressed their problem, you've showed how unique your product or service is, what you need them to do after watching the commercial. Of course, what you need them to do is either to buy, but buy how? Maybe by visiting your website, like it is being showed in this commercial. At the end, as you can see, at the end of this video, they say, welcome to Quaricha, and down they put for you www quaricha.com meaning after watching this commercial go straight to that link and maybe buy online and get what you need so call to action simply means what you want the viewers to do after watching the video or something like call now join us book now visit uh, visit us or follow us etc or stuff like that call to action what i recommend here guys try to make it at least one if you need to put more call to action like maybe call on this telephone number or visit our website just make it be maybe like two like adding your number and even a link of your website if you don't have a website yet maybe if your client doesn't have a website you can put it there their social media uh, social media handle but i recommend you just use only one call to action maybe a number or a website or a social media handle where people can reach you i hope you learned something out of this video in case you did go ahead and like it uh, like the video and even share the video with your friends fellow filmmakers our fellow photographers designers because this is a channel for you if you did so thank you see you in the next video god bless you